Vincent James McMahon was born on July 6, 1914, in Harlem, New York. His father was Roderick James McMahon, who was a wrestling and boxing promoter. It is unclear whether Vincent J. or his father Roderick founded Capital Wrestling Promotion in 1953, which eventually became the WWE. However, Roderick died in 1954 at the age of 72, when Vincent J. was 39 years old. Capital Wrestling Promotion was eventually renamed the Worldwide Wrestling Federation following a dispute with National Wrestling Alliance in April of 1963. The WWWF became the most dominant wrestling promotion in the Northeast during the 1950s and 60s, primarily in Baltimore, New York, and New Jersey. WWWF matches began airing on the Dumont Network in 1956 from Washington, D.C., and eventually Fox in New York City until 1971. According to the fabulous Moolah, Vincent J. McMahon was one of the first promoters to split gate proceeds with the wrestlers. He rarely came down to the squared circle and believed that wrestlers should not venture into other media. Consequently, Hulk Hogan was temporarily out of the WWF in 1982 as a result of his appearance in Rocky III. After rejoining the NWA in 1971, the WWWF was renamed the World Wrestling Federation in 1979 before it left the NWA for good in 1983. Vincent J. eventually sold the company to his son Vince McMahon in 1982. Mr. McMahon said that his father probably would have never sold him the company if he knew he wanted to make the company national and eventually worldwide in scope because he believed in wrestling having regional promotions. Unfortunately, Vincent J. did not live to see the growth of the WWE. He died on May 24, 1984, from pancreatic cancer at the age of 69. Vincent J. McMahon was inducted into the WWF Hall of Fame in 1996.